Ukrainian Air Force prepares to destroy another Russian A-50 aircraft over the Sea of Azov. Another Russian A-50 airborne early warning and control plane has appeared over the Sea of Azov, Ukrainian Air Force spokesman Yuri Inat said on national television. The plane is testing its fate, Inat said. The appearance of a new A-50 is no real surprise since Russia has several such aircraft in service, he pointed out, adding that despite a temporary lull in enemy air sorties after recent attacks, Ukraine could not afford to relax its vigilance. The Sea of Azov has been cleansed of Russian aviation, Inat said. Currently, there are practically one or two planes patrolling. This is actually a consequence of what happened recently, the A-50 plane and IL-22 command and control aircraft being left inoperative. There will be a solution, and those planes that are ready to perform tasks will fly from other airfields. Three A-50s were operating in the airspace not so long ago, two in the Azov area and the third in the east. They operate jointly with IL-22 command and control aircraft, perhaps because of certain forced measures, Inat said. They have more A-50 planes in their possession, unfortunately, but not dozens of them, only a few. There may be up to five repaired and modernized A-50s. The Air Force has dreamed of destroying such a target since the beginning of a full-scale invasion, Inat said, adding that Russia has suffered a huge loss of material and in reputation, in his opinion. If five of them were combat-able, then it decreases the number of Russia's air radars by 20%. This is a significant loss, he said. Ukrainian forces shot down an A-50 AWACS plane over the Azov Sea and damaged an IL-22M-11 airborne command post on January the 14th. This represented the first ever documented downing of an airborne early warning and control aircraft in history.